Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing great. So today I'm gonna to be doing a reading on Selena Gomez. So I don't know if you've seen it, but she recently posted a TikTok where she was basically um, responding to all of her body shamers. Um, you know, like all those people that are talking about her weight and about the fact that she like gained a lot of weight recently. And you know, she just posted a TikTok to respond to those people and just say, leave me alone. I don't care what you guys are saying. I just feel good about myself. So don't talk, sh don't talk shit about me. So I found it really interesting because, you know, like Selena has like, you know, she has lupus and like she has always been struggling to maintain her weight. Like she always fluctuated with her weight. And I want to know today how she feels about that. I want to know how she feels about her body. I want to know how she feels about herself. Is she confident? Does she love herself? Um, so this is what I'm going to ask Spirit today. So let's get started. So I have, I have brought my two favorite decks. So here I have the tarot cards and here I have this amazing deck. So now you got used to it, but I love it. So anyways, let's get started. Before starting the reading, don't forget to put a thumbs up. And if you want to get a private reading, just contact me on Instagram. I have linked my Instagram account in the description box. So just send me a message on Instagram and I will respond to you. And yeah, I will get you an appointment. So with that being said, let's get started. So I'm going to use this deck first. So I'm going to take one single card and ask Spirit, how does, so how does Selena Gomez feel about herself? How does she feel about her body? How does she feel about her? Does she love her? Does she love herself? How does she feel? Okay, there's too many cards here. I'm going to take only one card. How does Selena Gomez feel about her body, about herself? Thank you, Spirit. Thank you, Spirit. How does Selena Gomez feel about herself? Okay, I'm gonna take this card. Wow, what a beautiful card, you guys. Look at this card, oh my God. Wow, here we have Cancerian energy. This is Selena, Cancer. Look at that. So when you guys see that card, what comes to your mind? What's the first thing that comes to your mind? Immediately, personally, the word that came to my mind is peace. This card talks about peace, you guys. It talks about harmony. It talks about solace, you know? So look at that. Here we have a transition from night, nighttime to day, you know, to, to the sun. We have the moon that becomes the sun, you know? We have like the shadows that become light. So what I'm getting here is that Selena actually change her mindset she changed from um like sh she went from a position where she hated herself where she was where she had a toxic relationship with her body to now a situation where she loves herself okay to now a situation where she accepted herself okay and i'm thinking about rare beauty now as i'm saying this because you know the message of the brand is just love yourself, you are unique, you are rare, and accept who you are with all your flows, and just love yourself because you are unique, you know? And I feel like this is a connection to herself. I feel like this brand actually represents her mindset, you know? The idea and all of that just represents herself with, um, with her relationship with her body, you know, I feel like that now over the years, she has finally accepted who she was with all of her flaws, with all of her, you know, qualities, and she loves herself now. Wow, that's crazy, you guys. Oh my god, I love this card. Wow, that's crazy, because she literally came from this place to now loving herself, and this is beautiful. Look at this woman here. Look at her face. She is at peace. She's in peace, you know. She's just good. She feels great. She's in harmony with herself. Wow. Oh my God. I love that because, you know, Justin literally destroyed Selena's self-confidence. When you are with somebody for years, somebody that you love, and this person decide to leave you, and then one month later, marry somebody else. I'm sorry, but <laughs> this just destroyed your self-confidence, you know? So I feel like Justin very, really destroyed Selena's confidence but now she's finally 
gained it back. Wow, that's, oh my God, you guys, I'm so happy for her. That's incredible. So let's see. Let's see what the tarot cards want us to know. Okay, how does Selena Gomez feel about herself? Is there anything we should know about her? Thank you. Okay, this card wanted to come out. Selena Gomez, this card too, this one, and this one. Okay, let's see. Okay. Well, my, oh, okay, three of swords, two of wands, ooh, three of wands. And the six of um the six of pentacles. Wow. That's crazy, you guys. Because immediately immediately what I think. So I was I was just talking about Justin and the fact that she destroyed Selena. I feel like this is what this card talks about here. You know, she came from a really bad situation. Okay. I feel like look at her. This is her heart, you guys. She was literally destroyed. She was literally just you know, Selena destroyed her, uh, Justin destroyed her, and she felt really bad, her heart was broken, and so was her confidence, you know, and I feel like this card represents her past, how she felt, you know, because here we have the two of wands, which means ta um, taking a step back from the situation, looking at things with some distance, you know, taking distance from things and being distant from the world, and I think this is exactly what happened, you know? Once Justin um, married Haley, Selena was like completely out of the social media. She was like, we didn't know anything about her anymore. Like she was invisible. Like she literally hid herself from social media and from the world. And this is exactly what this card talks about here. Look at this, we have the, the planet, we have the world on his hand. And the man, is, and the man here is literally being distant from the world. He is looking at it. He is out of the world and he is looking at it. And I think this is exactly what happened with Selena. She took a step back. She took some distance from the world and she just healed herself, watched the, looked at the world and she needed to take some distance for her, for her mental health, you know? And exactly, because here we have the Six of Pentacles, which means that she gave money to somebody. And I feel like it talks about um, a psychologist, a therapist. I feel like she, you know, like she was in a, what's, what's the name? Like, you know, in a mental hospital. And, and she had, like, she went through a lot of therapy. And I feel like this card talks about that, you know. It's about like therapy and learning how to love yourself again, you know? Wow, okay, those cards are, are pretty positive because it means that she has evolved um, since that. Wow, the lover's card, interesting. Um, yes, she, she she is now in a relationship of love with her buddy, with herself. Look, look at that, the lover's card talked about love. This is her, okay, she loves herself. She's now in a relationship of love with herself. So is there anything else we should know about Selena? I want to know how does Selena feel about haters and about body shamers? How does she feel about all those hate comments? All those people talking shit about her? All those people talking, you know, saying that she is fat and all of that. How does Selena Gomez feel about all of that? Ace of Cups. Okay. Let's see. Two, three, and four. Let's see. Okay. Ooh, we have the Knight of Cups, the Fool card, and the Knight of Swords. Wow, immediately. So I'm going to put this card this way so you guys can see it. Immediately, what I what came to my mind was the Fool card. Look at this man here. So as you guys can see here, we have a man that is a, that is at the verge of a, of a mountain, and he is about to fall. You know, he is about to, to, to fall from the mountain. And he is not looking at it. He's not looking at um, the, 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 how do you call that? The shallow. But here we have his dog. His dog is trying to warn him. His dog is trying to, yeah, to warn him about the danger. But the guy here is not looking at his dog. He is ignoring it. So I feel like this is exactly the situation with Selena. She is ignoring the people. She is ignoring all the hate, all the comments, all the body shamers. This is her. You know, like the look, look at the guy here. He is happy. He's looking at the sun. He has a flower in his hand. And he is just 
ignoring all the hate okay he's not living with hate he's living with love and happiness so i feel like this is selena she is ignoring all those people okay she's ignoring all the body shamers look at that here we have the knight of cups which is a man that is crossing his his arms and he is just satisfied of himself and look at all those things all those cups behind his back that is selena she is good with herself and she just does not she does not let hate comments affect her look at this man he has crossed arms this is a position that means you don't let anything come or enter into you okay you don't let anything affect you you know this is a, a self-defense position and this is selena she's protecting protecting herself from all of those comments she is ignoring all those body shamers because she feels good about herself she knows she is worth something good and she knows her worth she knows that she is beautiful and she is unique look at that the hermit card that means that she is focused on herself that means that she doesn't care about the outside world she doesn't care about what other people can think she feels good about herself and she doesn't need anyone to love herself more than she does herself wow that's crazy you guys what a beautiful reading this is really positive apparently selena feels good about herself you guys apparently she loves herself and she just doesn't care about what people think of her. She doesn't care of what body shamers have to say. She feels good about her. She feels good about her body. And she doesn't care if she fluctuates with her weight. She accepted it. Look at that card again. She is in peace with herself. Period. Wow, you guys, this is all for this reading. I hope you guys liked it. If you did, don't don't forget to put a thumbs up. And again, if you want to if you want to get a private reading, just consult me on Instagram. I have linked my Instagram account on the description box, so just check it out and send me a message. With that being said, I see you guys tomorrow for, at 10 a.m. Pacific time for a new video. Bye!